Hi everyone, it's Tammy and I have a present here. This is from Plum Paper and this is hopefully the planner for my daughter's boyfriend. He um, is in college and Katie thought that he might like to have a planner for uh, Christmas. And I said, well, that's kind of a good gift for me to give him because I didn't really know exactly what to get him. I've gotten him a couple things, but I needed something else, and I thought that this would be nice. So um, when she told me that he'd like one, I thought, well, I'll do that. And I tried to pick out, you know, a planner that was kind of manly. So I got the black and white striped one. And she picked out the horizontal two for him because that's what she has and she thought that he would like that best. So it starts with January. So let's see, the first page is a weekly planner and it has the, you know, the nice thick plum paper cover. And this planner belongs to, and then it has the, the year at a glance and then special dates. And this paper is amazing. Ideas, plans, and goals. And then it starts off with January and has the goal page over here where you can write birthdays and things to remember and such. And then just a notes page. And then the monthly view. Oh my goodness, I just love this paper. And then here is the horizontal. This is horizontal two for um, any of you guys that are interested. But has a notes section up here and then a space for Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Looks like these are just... Maybe not. I was going to say, it looks like they're just a hair smaller, but I don't think they are. I think that all of them are about the same. I guess I could look at, well, if I had my ruler handy. Oh, I do. Here it is. So let's see. These are, well, about two and two. I don't know what that is, but yeah, I think Sunday is just a little smaller. Sunday's for sure a little smaller. So I wonder if Wednesday is too. Yeah, Wednesday and Sunday are just a tad bit smaller. But then that's what it looks like for every... And then when you get to every week, and then when you get to the week that shares January and February, because we're still under the January tab, all of February's is grayed out. And then the last page is just a notes page. And then it goes to February. And in February, all of January's will be grayed out. And then it starts February. So it's the same for all of them. And then here are the different tab colors. There's kind of a lilac. And then that matches all of the pages on the inside of that tab. Here's like a peach for April. And there's what one of the weeks looks like. A little darker for May and there's the week and even darker for June and there's a the week and then we get to July which is green and there's a week of July and August September Kind of a mint, and then October, which is getting a little more like sea foam green. There, that's better. And then November is kind of a teal color, and then December is another purple. And then I did have a fitness section added for him because they've been into fitness and this is what the fitness section looks like. Um, it has fitness st fitness statistics and it has start date, start pounds, start BMI, end date, end pounds, end BMI, your measurements, affirmation statement, long-term goals, motivation, short-term goals, and then milestones and what reward and what date those were on. And then it has your monthly fitness of week one, two, three, four, five for you to write 
your weight, and then monthly goals, this month's fitness plan, measurements, highs and lows, notes, and rewards. And then here's your monthly fitness, and it has every day, well, 1 through 31, for you to write your exercise, your time, distance, sets, and reps, and then for you to track your water intake. And there's one of these for every month of the year. So you can keep track of all of that. And then here's um, another monthly fitness page. Oh, that's, oh, maybe that's just the last one. And then here's a weight, weight progress chart. And then here are just some dotted pages. There's two of those. And then passwords and contacts. And the U.S. holidays for the 17, 18, and 19. And then here's another um, week at a glance for 2018. And then the last is a little folder that you can store stuff in, and it's both-sided. And then here's the back cover. And it has the stripes. And then that clear plastic vinyl. So I didn't get his name on it or anything. This is just kind of a plain planner. Um, I thought that he'd like that best. So that is that. Thanks so much, guys. I love these planners. You can't go wrong. Plumpaper.com. I'll try to remember to put it below. If I forget, please let me know. Thanks, guys.